In this video, we'll share the top 25 things to do in Maryland. At number one, we have the National Aquarium. Located in the inner harbor of Baltimore, the National Aquarium is a vibrant aquatic wonderland. It's home to thousands of marine creatures from around the world, offering visitors an immersive experience into the mysteries of the ocean. From the vibrant coral reefs to the mysterious depths of the Atlantic, every exhibit is a testament to the diversity of life beneath the waves. At number two, we have the U.S. Naval Academy. Situated in Annapolis, the U.S. Naval Academy is a beacon of military education and discipline. Visitors can explore the sprawling campus, marvel at the grand architecture, and learn about the rigorous training that future naval officers undergo. The guided tours offer a glimpse into the life of midshipmen and the rich history of this prestigious institution. At number three, we have Oriole Park at Camden Yards. This iconic baseball stadium in Baltimore is the home of the Baltimore Orioles. Known for its retro-style design and fan-friendly amenities, Oriole Park offers an unmatched baseball experience. The stadium's Utah Street and Park area blend old-school charm with modern facilities, creating a unique atmosphere for both sports and architecture enthusiasts. At number four, we have the Fort McHenry National Monument and Historic Shrine. This historic site in Baltimore played a crucial role in the War of 1812 defending the city from British invasion. It's also the birthplace of the Star-Spangled Banner, the national anthem of the United States. Visitors can explore the fort, learn about its history, and enjoy panoramic views of the Baltimore Harbor. At number five, we have Ocean City Beach. This beautiful, clean beach is a favorite among locals and tourists alike. With its wide, sandy shores and gentle waves, it's the perfect place for a day of relaxation and fun. Whether you're looking to soak up the sun, take a leisurely stroll, or indulge in some water sports, Ocean City Beach offers something for everyone. At number six, we have the Ocean City Boardwalk. This bustling boardwalk is the heart of Ocean City, offering a variety of shops, restaurants, and entertainment options. It's a great place to enjoy a leisurely walk, indulge in some retail therapy, or simply sit back and people watch. The boardwalk also offers stunning views of the beach, making it a must-visit spot in Ocean City. At number seven, we have Fells Point. This historic neighborhood in Baltimore is known for its vibrant nightlife, eclectic shops, and diverse dining options. The cobblestone streets and waterfront views add to the charm of Fells Point, making it a popular destination for both locals and tourists. Whether you're looking to enjoy a meal, shop for unique finds, or simply take in the scenic views, Fells Point has something to offer. At number eight, we have Assateague Island National Seashore. This beautiful island park is a haven for nature lovers. Known for its wild horses, diverse bird life, and miles of coastline, Assateague Island offers a unique outdoor experience. Visitors can enjoy hiking, bird watching, or simply relaxing on the beach while taking in the serene beauty of the island. At number nine, we have the Walters Art Museum. Located in the Mount Vernon neighborhood of Baltimore, the Walters Art Museum houses a diverse collection of art from around the world. From ancient Egyptian artifacts to European masterpieces, the museum offers a journey through the ages. Its convenient location near the city's free bus line makes it easily accessible for visitors. At number 10, we have the Inner Harbor. This bustling waterfront area in Baltimore is a hub of activity, offering a variety of attractions for all ages. From the National Aquarium and Maryland Science Center, to a plethora of dining and shopping options, there's something for everyone at the Inner Harbor. Visitors can also enjoy boat tours or rent paddle boats for a unique way to explore the harbor. At number 11, we have Antietam National Battlefield. This historic site in Sharpsburg was the scene of the bloodiest single-day battle in American history during the Civil War. Visitors can explore the battlefield, learn about the events that took place, and pay their respects at the National Cemetery. The site also offers stunning views of the surrounding countryside. At number 12, we have the American Visionary Art Museum. This unique museum in Baltimore is dedicated to showcasing the work of self-taught artists. With its eclectic collection of art, the museum offers a different perspective on creativity and expression. From whimsical sculptures to thought-provoking installations, every exhibit is a testament to the power of imagination. At number 13, we have the Sagamore Spirit Distillery. This distillery in Baltimore is known for its rye whiskey. Visitors can take a tour of the distillery, learn about the history and process of whiskey making in Maryland, and sample some of their finest spirits. 
The distillery also offers stunning views of the harbor, making it a great place to relax and enjoy a drink. At number 14, we have the Horseshoe Casino. This bustling casino in Baltimore offers a wide range of gaming options, from slot machines to table games. Whether you're a seasoned gambler or a novice looking for some fun, the Horseshoe Casino has something to offer. The casino also features several dining options, making it a great place for a night out. At number 15, we have the Adventure Park at Sandy Spring. This outdoor adventure park offers a variety of fun and challenging activities for all ages. From zip lines to obstacle courses, there's plenty to keep you entertained. Set among the trees, the park offers a unique way to enjoy the outdoors and get some exercise. At number 16, we have Swallow Falls State Park. This state park is known for its beautiful waterfalls and old-growth forests. Visitors can enjoy hiking trails that wind through the park, offering stunning views of the falls and the surrounding nature. The park is also home to some of the oldest hemlock trees in Maryland, some of which are over 300 years old. At number 17, we have the Chesapeake Bay Maritime Museum. This museum in St. Michael's offers a glimpse into the rich maritime history of the Chesapeake Bay. From boat building to seafood harvesting, the museum covers various aspects of life on the bay. Visitors can also enjoy stunning views of the bay from the museum's waterfront location. At number 18, we have Assateague State Park. This state park on Assateague Island is known for its wild ponies, sandy beaches, and diverse wildlife. Visitors can enjoy a variety of outdoor activities, including hiking, bird watching, and camping. The park's location on the island also offers stunning views of the Atlantic Ocean. At number 19, we have the Annapolis Historic District. This charming district in Annapolis is known for its historic buildings, including the Maryland State House and the U.S. Naval Academy. Visitors can take a stroll through the district, explore the various shops and restaurants, and learn about the city's rich history. At number 20, we have the Baltimore Museum of Art. This museum in Baltimore is known for its impressive collection of modern and contemporary art. The museum's Cone Collection, which includes works by renowned artists like Matisse and Picasso, is a must-see for art enthusiasts. The museum also features a sculpture garden and a variety of rotating exhibits. At number 21, we have the B&O Railroad Museum. This museum in Baltimore is dedicated to the history of American railroading. With its collection of historic locomotives and rail cars, the museum offers a glimpse into the past. Visitors can also enjoy a ride on a vintage train, offering a unique experience for all ages. At number 22, we have the Maryland Science Center. This interactive science center in Baltimore offers a variety of exhibits and activities for all ages. From exploring the wonders of the human body to learning about the mysteries of the universe, the center offers a fun and educational experience. The center's IMAX theater and planetarium are also popular attractions. At number 23, we have the Chesapeake and Ohio Canal National Historical Park. This park preserves the historic canal that was once a lifeline for communities along the Potomac River. Visitors can enjoy hiking, biking, or boating along the canal, or explore the various historic sites within the park. At number 24, we have the Maryland Zoo. Located in Baltimore, this zoo is home to a variety of animals from around the world. Visitors can explore the African Journey exhibit, meet the penguins in the Penguin Coast exhibit, or learn about Maryland's local wildlife in the Maryland Wilderness Exhibit. At number 25, we have the Catoctin Mountain Park. This park in Thurmont offers a variety of outdoor activities, including hiking, camping, and fishing. The park's scenic vistas and diverse wildlife make it a popular destination for nature lovers. Visitors can also explore the historic cabins and structures within the park, offering a glimpse into the area's past. So that sums up my top 25 things to do in Maryland. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.